First it was fire, now Colleen police say it is also a homicide investigation. The victim ID'd as Robin Ashford. 25 News reporter Leah McNeil is live with, exclusive, with an exclusive interview from her family. Leah. Well, Todd Naya, Colleen police have recently released additional information about this case, saying that they have identified a person of interest, but stopped short of releasing any additional information. Now I'm here on scene where that apartment fire happened earlier on Monday. The wind is carrying that smell of smoke through the air, that fire long gone, but the hole that is felt within Robin's family and close friend circle is still there. Robin actually worked here in Colleen alongside her sister, Rinda Rankins, and her mother at their family's hair salon. Robin stayed is now empty. It is, I'm, 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 it's, it's ter it's, it tears me up. This is my sister's station. As she sits in her sister's salon chair, Rinda Rankins recalls every detail from the moment her life changed forever. So we rushed over to the scene, and when I was going there, and I seen all the lights, and, and the way the setup was when I got on her street, I knew. Walking through Robin's charred apartment. I was, just, I was just so confused. I was just so confused. You know, like, you know, so much stuff was running through my head. Questions still linger today, but those who knew her best are remembering Robin as a beacon of light. It's your birthday. Go, Carla. It's your birthday. Now, she was the type of person who you will always remember her, regardless of. You know, when the parties was come, would come, you'll just be expecting her to come. And when she came, she came. A social butterfly. We have so many videos of Robin. With a heart of gold. <laughs> Where she was just Robin having a good time. A fiery, fun-loving, faithful woman. All praises to them, it was higher. We remember we used to tell her she needed her own TV show. <laughs> we used to tell her, you need your own show and just sit there and conversate and laugh with people. She something else. She was something else. Whose presence will never be forgotten. That spot is just not going to be the same. You know, it's just not going to be the same. Now, in that release, police believe that some members in the community may know more information about what happened here. They are urging anyone with details to come forward. But Robin's sister, Renda, says that it is an immense hole in their family, that family still coping with the loss of multiple family members throughout the past few years. Now, at one of Robin's favorite hangout spots, O'Malley's, they will be hosting a balloon re release on Sunday at 430. Robin leaves behind three children and a grandchild. Live in Colleen, Leah McNeil, 25 News. Leah, thank you. Now, KPD has not released much information regarding this case, but again, if you do have any information, you are urged to contact police.